Hey guys, I just started watching the Great British Bake Off show and it made me really want to make a lemon drizzle cake, so here it is. Me and my mom both enjoyed it so much. It's so lemony. Starting off, you want to zest two lemons. Try not to over zest them, we just need the yellow part. Juice, one and a half lemons. We're saving half a lemon for garnishing later. I highly recommend using a juicer to juice your lemons. It's so much more easier and you get so much juice out of it. I prefer using a bench scraper to cut my butter because bench scrapers are so much more safer than knives. It's so much easier to cut things. Since my butter isn't soft yet, I'm going to beat it in the mixer until it's softened. You don't have to, this is already softened. Add in the sugar and cream it together with the butter until it's pale in color. Every now and then, you want to scrape the bowl just to make sure you get everything using a spatula. Once it's nicely creamed, we add it in our eggs. We have four eggs, but we're adding them one at a time to incorporate the eggs. If you put them all at once, it won't mix in well. So I'm just adding an egg and slowly mixing this. Every now and then, I want to scrape the bowl to make sure everything's well mixed. And then you add in another egg, you mix it. Add another egg and mix it. And be sure to scrape it for one final last time and mix. We sift in our flour. And baking powder. Make sure you get an even level of baking powder in that one teaspoon. Add in our lemon zest. I'm just gonna fold this together until no white spots remain. Prepare your loaf tin by spraying down with pan oil and dusting it with flour and add in your batter. Bake this at 325 degrees Fahrenheit for one hour or until it passes the toothpick test. To make your glaze, combine together the sugar and lemon juice. And just stir this together. When it's done baking, poke holes using a skewer or a fork and slowly pour on your lemon juice sugar. And let it cool completely. I'm just garnishing with leftover lemons. Thank you for watching. Bye!